Everyone wants my channel today. We're doing reading for Santa Scorpio, and keep in mind that this does not resonate for every Scorpio. If you like a personal reading, it's gonna be the first link in the description down below. Repeat that. First link in the description down below for a personal reading. You also find much other things there in the description. You can find my Etsy shop, which has my tarot and my oracle cards on there. A bunch of things there on my Etsy shop in the description down below. You should definitely go check that out. Usually have a sale going on. Uh, you can also find my shirt store on my website, different social media platforms I'm on, as well as Patreon. All that's in the description down below. If you'd like to donate to the channel, feel free to do so. I do preach donations here for Scorpio. Let's see what spirit has in store for yourself. We already have cards falling out. We have number 48, disengage from outcomes. Let go so you can open yourself to the highest love that you deserve. Find ways to release worry or unresolved lack of forgiveness you might be holding on to. Okay. Number 25, a breakthrough to new dimensions and a new endeavor is on the horizon. Innovative energy wants to burst forth into your consciousness. And number 10, every step counts. There's an advantage in taking things slowly. Breathe deeply and fully as you consider your options, Scorpio. So we have something new coming to your horizon. Don't try to, like, don't worry about it, all right? Don't have that worry about, like, is it going to work out? What's happening with it? Like, don't worry about the outcome. Just, like, take... Take your time with it. Be slow about it. It's okay to be slow sometimes. Number 17, safe and surrounded by love. Keep your heart uh, keep your heart open. You know that you're being protected. Listen to what you know to be true. I don't even need this book because it's really cards. Anyways, listen to what you know to be true. And allow yourself to see and understand what is going on around you. Number 9, with amble with contentment. Waiting rather than acting is going to be most advantageous now. Number 47, connect to source. Go within to discover what needs to be done. Create the shift required to attract what you want. Number 1, with resilience. There's no need to rush or push. This is a time to take things as they come. You have the determination to, and patience to handle what is happening. Number 37, look beyond the surface. Avoid becoming distracted by surface issues. Focus on the underlying motivation, cause, or beauty in a situation. Seek ways to bring depth to your world. Number eight, with keeping it in check. Pay attention to what is going on around you. You might be moving into something too quickly or missing some important details. You see that? Slow down. Pay attention to these details, Scorpio. Okay? I'm telling you to wait slow. Look deeper into it. Don't rush with it. Going within as well. Within yourself. Connect to the source. Connect to yourself. Connect to spirit. Slow down. All right, one big message here. But you're also being protected. All right. You're surrounded by love. You're surrounded by protection here. Now, Scorpio, one thing that we do see here, the dolphins. Dolphins are connected to that of Poseidon. Is that maybe who you're connecting with at the moment? What is surrounding you? That being. Number 14, single mindedness. Choose your own path and what is best suited to you. Number 13, gliding through currents. With a different approach, you'll glide through a situation with grace and ease, going inward and bringing your understanding, perspective, or behavior into flow will help your dreams take flight. Number 21, enjoy the journey. Stay present and flexible. Many changes are going on for you and around you. These changes are not only good, but necessary. Bring your awareness into the now, rather than focusing on the past or future. It's telling you, like, enjoy the journey that you're going through, right? steps. Number 23, distinctive potential. Rely on your faith and the knowledge that nothing's impossible. Use your determination to hang in there until you realize a goal. Oh, drop it. Number 5, change direction with ease. This is time for a change, shape-shifting from your soul, or your soul's evolution. 
It is a time to reconsider what you are wanting. You may be in for a surprise. Number three, within the light of the moon. A full moon can shine light on what you've been resisting. This could be anything from your fears to your soul's beauties. Number 49, be insight insightful and established. Ground and rebalance your energy. Bring your awareness into the now rather than allowing it to occupy the past or future. Being in the now, Scorpio. Changing the shift here, your focus. You're going to be changing your direction here, and when it feels like it's towards something new, and you're going to discover that things are going to be flowing a lot more easier for you. It's not going to be so hard. All right, Scorpio, you're going to be doing more of what you want to do rather than what other people want you to be doing. All right, and there's a lot of potential with that. Also connected with this moon here. Nine with empower yourself. Tune into your personal power. You are more than able to handle the situation facing you. Allow yourself to be the strong, beautiful person you are capable of being. Number 34, the gift of neutrality. Balance is at work in your life. Yin and yang are opposites in energy but reside side by side to create the gift of neutrality. 12, replacing what was lost. You now have the opportunity to rejuvenate and start anew, created with a new perspective or outlook. This card may also indicate abundance on the horizon. So maybe, you may, things that you have lost in your life here, Scorpio, they're going to be replaced, right? These be possessions, you know, people, whatever. Things that you've lost in your life are not going to be replaced here. What feels like with this full moon? All right, you're empowering yourself as well, doing things that you're wanting to do. Number seven, dancing in the rainbow. Break free from whatever you feel is holding you back. Express happiness. Find what you truly desire. See, going after what you truly desire, your heart's desires here, what you truly want. Empowering yourself, you know. Living your own life, Scorpio. Number 41, convey your meaning. Reflect on the way you communicate with others and with yourself. Be sure to express your thoughts and feelings from your heart and with respect and sincerity. Scorpio, communicate clearly. Number six, looking at the underbelly. Be sure you're using your time in the best possible manner. You might consider taking time to organize yourself, or perhaps a project you're working on could use some fine-tuning. Number 46, with facing your fears. Look for ways to strengthen your connection to the universe and others. Stay peaceful and calm in the knowing of who you are. Number 11, with persistent drive. See what you desire and move toward that goal. It is time to zero in on your purpose. Use your intuition and instincts to guide you for the optimal outcome. It's facing your fears here. Empowering yourself. Really being persistent here on your goal. Whether this be a project, multiple projects, things that you're wanting to do here, Scorpio. Alright, do some fine tuning on that. And everything's just going to work out. Everything's going to be flowing for you. Number 20 with shared inspiration, throw yourself into a new project. Be willing to let go of time constraints and rules and really be aware of whatever fills your heart. Number 2, diving to new depths. This is There is a deeper meaning to what is happening. You might be looking at this from the surface and missing what is really going on. See, looking, look beyond the surface. Take a moment to pause and breathe. Allow yourself to dive, dive deeper into what is it you are feeling about your current situation. Number 38, shedding the old. There's a change coming your way. Cultivate a sense of adventure. So you'll be able to see these new prospects. See, shedding the old. Going on to the new, seeing deeper. All right, Scorpio. Going towards your passions, towards what, you, what your heart desires. Number 43, setting up parameters. Assess your relationships and determine how they are aligned with your goals. Setting boundaries requires an honest evaluation of your present relationships. For 27, push to the surface. You see, you may have become complacent, you might be stalling or in need of a new surge of energy. Become aware of the dynamics in your life. Becoming like, what is it? Reflect on your life here, Scorpio, and shutting that old, what does not serve you anymore, setting those boundaries. 
Or 50, with childlike devotion, you are a multi-talented, complex being. Embrace and love who you are. Number four, with life is better together. Seek assistance from your community. Connect with family or friends or others who will support you. It can be as simple as making a phone call. What I feel like here is that there's going to be people who also have the same passion as you do. Like they're into the same things that you are into. Like a community here, Scorpio. All right. That shared inspiration. Life is better together. Number 33, with let your personality shine. You have something no one else has that makes you who you are. Stop comparing yourself to others and allow your uniqueness to shine through it. Being yourself here, Scorpio's big message. So let's get some runes and charms yourself. We have Ra. We have a Chinese Zodiac sign. The monkey here. Whenever you're going through a spiritual initiation, there's rewards coming in. There's flow. Things are flowing more. This gateway. Things have been still. Everything's gonna work out fine for you, Scorpio. So that's all I have for you. Like I said. First link in the description down below for personal reading. Also go to my Etsy shop. Go in there, go buy something. Really appreciate that. If you want to see more content, don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye, guys.